think it was Time Magazine in maybe 1992 had a cover that said the internet and it was all about how it was for the dark net, you know? Uh, and that was very much the Bitcoin story a year ago. I'm finding we've, we've matured out of that story. I think people are sort of realizing that um, one, anything can be used for, for illicit means. And two, actually, this is not the ideal thing to use for illicit means because though it is private, it is fully traceable. Blockchain technology is a distributed ledger. And so it allows for the, the permanent, immutable, transparency, transparent recording of, of data, essentially, um, and transactions specifically. And so that can be used to you know, exchange any number of things that have value, whether that's an actual item. It could be you know, tea leaves making all, their way all the way to sort of final tea maker. Um, or it could be me sending you a payment person to person without the need for intermediaries. I think of Bitcoin as being sort of uh, the entry point to a, a, a digital future where everything that we, um, everything of value can and likely will be exchanged in digital format. Central banks will look to the Bitcoin experience to build central bank backed uh, digital assets. And then I think from an enterprise perspective where you move away from, from Bitcoin specifically and, and take what you learn from that to apply it to other use cases, you look at things like supply chains. You can use blockchain technology to help trace that, right? And so you can, you can essentially assign um, a tag to items across the supply chain and record each movement down the chain on, on a blockchain. What I think we, we will have is private blockchains that, that fit into the public blockchains. Um, similar to the way we think about internet and intranets, so if you look back at sort of when the internet came out, a lot of companies had a very similar path where, oh, internet sounds interesting, we're actually interested in intranets. We want to do this internal connectivity. Ultimately, intranets didn't radically change our world. But they are a useful part of the ecosystem, right? They allow our businesses to interact with one another internally and then ultimately plug into a more public domain. And so I think that is ultimately what we're going to see is, is these partnerships, this collaborative uh, process where we, we have companies using private blockchains that sit atop public blockchains.